Say good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Where are we headed? To eat? Yeah. We're yeah. going to go eat and go shopping? Yeah. yeah. Oh, we need masks. Let's not forget that. Let me grab the mask. Forgot. We are at a place called Backyard Burgers. We've never been here. How is yeah, it, Millie? Uh, like we have hot dogs and mac and cheese, and I got a burger. It's pretty good, though. Y'all like it? Is it good? Mm -hmm. It's pretty good. Good morning, and welcome back to my channel. We just got done with lunch at Backyard Burgers. We've never been there before. I, I'm guessing it's like a chain thing. It's the only one, like, I'm, we've never heard of it until they built one here in this town. Um, I, it was pretty good. It was a pricey for like a fast food place, I feel like. But it was good though. Like, I would come back. I got a burger, and everybody else got hot dogs, except Rand got uh, mac and cheese. The burger was like super done. Like, they're like flame broiled. What do you call it? Flame broiled, flame grilled, something. It was super, super done though. So, I um, don't like they done it like too much. But it was, I would come back again. It was pretty good. We are headed shopping. We were going out of town this week after the week after Christmas. We actually had an Airbnb booked in the mountains and I canceled it within the time frame we could and cancel it for, you know, and get all of our money back. And we decided if we wanted to go, we would do like a spontaneous trip. We'd just um, book something else if we wanted to go because I just didn't want to commit to, was it three or four days we were going? Three or four days, three or four nights we were going. So I canceled it and we decided to stay home. Even up till last night, we were like, should we go? Should we go ahead and book something and leave tomorrow? And we just kind of just decided to stay home this time. Um, kind of take it easy, but. Now we're headed shopping. I woke up and I, I see then I was like, can we run to Home Goods? And Home Goods from us is about an hour away. Um, so after I took down all my Christmas decor, my house feels so empty. I have like no home decor because we really didn't. There's a few things that I brought from our old house when we moved, but. Um, not really much of anything. So that's where we're headed. We're gonna go see like what all we can find. I need to, there's several things. Like my living room feels bare and empty. All, like I had so much Christmas things and I didn't want, that's the first, any decor for our house I bought. It was all Christmas stuff because we were almost at Christmas. And I haven't bought any like neutral decor and that's what I wanna decorate with up until like from now probably till like the fall time like just neutral decor that i can leave up all year long that i don't have to go out and spend a bunch of money on more decor so that's where we're going is home goods and see what we can find i ordered something on amazon last night to go somewhere and i'm gonna find something to go kind of along with that for my living room and then i need to decorate my foyer table and so that's kind of my goal is to kind of see what we can find for that today <music> Then I went in Kirkland's and found a couple things. And then, all oh, that car's turning. And then um, we just got out of Target and found a few things in Target that we needed. Um, I got a few things for the house, but also I got the girls, I'm gonna change out the girls' curtains to what they had at our old house and put Millie's curtains back in her room once we do Millie's room. Um, so we got a few things in Target. Now we're headed to Sam's Club to get some things. Toilet paper and paper towels. Every time we go, they are out of both of those. So I'm hoping they'll have toilet paper and paper towels so we can stock up on that. 
and then um, maybe some food items too. So I'll show y'all Sam's Club haul as well. Um, I'm not gonna do any decorating today just because I don't have near what I need to decorate. So I don't, I don't really wanna start decorating until I have, I think I'll show y'all everything I got later when I get home, but I don't wanna start decorating until I have Maybe I'll go out tomorrow. I think there's things that I'm gonna go look at at Walmart and then I haven't been to Hobby Lobby at all So I know Hobby Lobby is gonna probably have some things that we can decorate with um, So I think I'll show you a haul when I get home, but as far as Decorating the house, I think I'll wait until tomorrow to do that and I may um, Bring it along tomorrow as well, but we're gonna go to Sam's Club and I'll show y'all a Sam's Club haul as well or Whatever we decide to get at Sam's Club. All right. Do we get stocked up on a few things yeah. and even a pretzel? And a sun kiss, right? We got a few things, not a ton of stuff. All right, just got home. Everybody's playing. <laughs> just got a really small um, Sam's order. Pretty small. We needed mainly, every time we go, they are out of tool paper and paper towels. So we got both of those. We also need a laundry detergent. So um, this is, what is it? Um, milk, coconut milk and honey. So I thought I'd try that one. And I love Gain Laundry Detergent. That's what we've been using lately at least. It just smells so good. Ren saw this. I was looking at all the pre-made dinners because I was going to grab one for supper tonight. And Ren begged for this. And it was only like $3. So <laughs> but the kids might have that for dinner. Um, or whoever wants it might have it for dinner. I love getting these mashed potatoes because mashed potatoes is like my favorite side to eat. And it, they're so good. They're like homemade mashed potatoes. And you just stick them in the, I believe, microwave. And they're delicious. So I grabbed those. And then I grabbed a thing of orange juice, and that's just our little Sam's Club haul. Um, we were kind of in a hurry too, because Millie was being really fussy in Sam's Club, so we just kind of just got a few things that we really needed. All right, you're gonna have to excuse the lighting in this video. It's gotten pretty dark outside by this point, but I wanted to show y'all a haul of what I got today. Like I said earlier, when I bought this house, I pretty much did not bring, brought a few of our home decor items, and that is it. So we have literally nothing to decorate our home with. So that's something that we knew we had to budget for so I can decorate. And these are things that are gonna stay up until the fall time when I wanna add fall things to my decor as well. So these are gonna stay up for a very several months. Um, but I know I needed to kind of need to splurge on the things that need I need to decorate for like year-round decorations um, because I don't have really any of that. So that's why we went shopping to start that to decorate my house. My house feels so empty right now. And I knew we moved in our house October. So I knew it was gonna be a slow process decorating, but now that we're done with Christmas, I've gotta get this started. So we went to Home Goods. I've got stuff from Home Goods, Kirkland's, and I've got stuff from Target as well. And I'm gonna go to Walmart and Hobby Lobby tomorrow to hopefully finish out what I want to get. And then I have a couple things coming from Amazon tomorrow as well that I've ordered. Um, so, First of all, one of the kind of bigger things we got, we walked in Home Goods and saw this, and Ethan has a plant that he got that was at his papa's funeral. His papa recently passed away not too long ago, and we knew we wanted to replant that. I need to cut the baby monitor off because y'all probably hear the kids back there playing. We knew we wanted to replant that something to make it a little bit taller and stand up. Um, right now we have it beside our foyer table and I think our foyer table and I think it'll stay there We just wanted to replant that so we both just loved this and I feel like it was a really good price It was like $25. So we got that to replant that um, And then I'll say from home goods I got a big thing and I'm gonna show you that last because it's really big and I can't just hold it up Okay, and then what I got two sets of the same kind of curtains. I really wanted like neutral white curtains I can't decide if I'm gonna put these in the living room and then the dining area or put these in the living room and then the other set put them in our bedroom. I have got to cut this monitor off because it is loud. <laughs> okay. I had some other ones picked out for our kitchen area that were like a gr really light gray buffalo plaid and then I had them in my shopping cart and I was like, well, let me look at the measurements and they're too long. I, I'm glad I realized that because we live too far from home goods to be able to, to have to like go back and exchange them or take them back. Um, which home goods is like in with Marshalls and stuff, isn't it? Could I bring them back to Marshalls? Maybe I could have done that. I don't know. Anyways, so um, I thought it was a really good price. This is a set of four pan curtain panels and um, 
Madison Studios, the brand. They're white and they've got like a texture to them. Don't really know if that texture is really showing up, but I just love just a plain white. So I got those. Like I said, for the living room, I think for sure, maybe the dining area, or if not the dining area, we'll put them in our bedroom. So I got two of the same ones. And then, um, I think that's, uh, there's one other thing I got from Home Goods, and I'll show that last. And then from Target, I grabbed this throw, really pretty white throw. I think I'm gonna throw this over something we are doing it in our living room area. So I got that for that. Um, and then I got the girls this. This is what they did have in their bedroom. And then um, they needed one more. And we're going to switch out the ones that I just put in there. The white and pink striped looking ones. And we're going to switch those out for these. And put the white and pink ones back in Millie's room. Because they just look so good. So cute in Millie's room. Um, and then also from Target I grabbed a tension rod. Is that what it's called? Yes, a tension rod. And I'm hoping this is going to work out. I'm afraid it might be a little long. And if it is, I said I'll just bring it back. But I also grabbed a um, light filtering valence for our above our sink. And I think what I'm going to do is put it like halfway down and then like keep it open for the most part. I'm afraid it still might be a little long. I'm hoping it's not going to be. We really just need something there. I kind of want to do something besides like our white, line, white blinds that we have in the rest of our house. Don't know if it's going to work, but I got it just to see. Um, and then lastly, I picked up a two-pack of pillowcases for our bedroom. Um, we needed two extra ones to put our extra pillows on our bed. And then I forgot to show these. These were also from Home Goods. I got these for our bedroom. They are really big pillows, and I've been looking for really big pillows like this. And I thought the price was good, and it was, um, I, I just really liked them. Ethan liked the gray stripe and then just the little kind of palms, I guess you could call it. I don't know. I, th I really liked it. So it was a two pack that I thought we put on our bed. The only other thing I need for our bed is like a cute throw um, and maybe one more colored pillow. I'm not sure yet. Um, and then Kirkland's, I got this tray to set, I think, on our foyer table. And I think I'll put some things in here like a picture frame of all of us, candle. Maybe like a, some kind of little greenery plant. I'm not sure yet for sure, but I thought I'd put, put that on our um, foyer table. And then the other thing I got in Kirkland's, actually two other things I got in Kirkland's. I was able to use a 25% off coupon for two of these things. Um, I got this throw. Actually, this throw might go on our bed. I'm not sure yet. If it don't go on our bed, it might go in the living room on, um, we may keep it on our couch. Uh, but I got that cute throw. I thought it was really cute. It's not super cozy, but it is cute. So I kind of got it more for decorations. All right, and the last couple things I got. This is from Kirkland's. I'll just have to show y'all when we put it together um, sometime the, later on in the next couple days, maybe. This is for the girls' bathroom. I was actually, I had already checked out at Kirkland's and I saw it hanging on the wall. It's a circle, like wooden metal wall shelf. And I got it for the girls' bathroom. Because the shelf we had in the bathroom in our old house, we left it there since it was like screwed to the wall. So we decided we would leave that for the other owners. But we needed something for their bathroom because I kept all the other decor for it. So I grabbed that. It was a good price, especially with the coupon. So I'll have to show y'all that because there's not a picture on here. And lastly, I grabbed this bench. And there's one of two things I'm going to do with it. Number one, I'm either just going to leave it in here because I really wanted a bench to go at the bottom of our bed. So I may leave it in here or there's something I'm doing in our living room that that's the main reason I got it for. But I decided if it don't look right, then I'm leaving it here because it looks really good in here. So stay tuned. I'm not sure exactly, but I think it's going to go in our living room. If I don't love it in there, then we're just going to leave it in our bedroom because we really needed like a little bench to go at the bottom of our bed. And we've got plenty of room for it in this room. Um, so yeah, stay tuned for decorating because... In the next couple of days, I will bring it along and I'll get everything hopefully decorated. <laughs> you want to try next? All right, we are starting supper. We still got to put all this up. We need to rearrange our um, linen closet. We have a pretty big linen closet. Let's try. We have a pretty big linen closet. We said we need to kind of make some space to set these in there neatly and rearrange all that there's so many things we need to rearrange i mean just showing y'all my pantry actually i'm doing a big grocery order tomorrow but this is in desperate need of cleaning out 
and organizing, but like I said, I'll get to that one day. I keep saying that. But we're gonna make supper. The kids, I think I'm gonna do, Ethan and I are not hungry. We're gonna wait till later. By the way, I got really hot, so I changed and put my hair up. We're gonna wait until after the kids go to bed because the kids didn't really have a good nap today, so they can go to bed at a pretty early time tonight. So we're gonna wait till they go to bed, and one of us will probably run out and grab supper. And, um, I've got, I've got to finish up my grocery order for tomorrow. We need groceries so badly. We've been eating out a ton lately. Cause I just need to go to the grocery store. So I'm going to post a big grocery order. And what do you want? Rian wants mac and cheese, the one I bought from Sam's Club. Lainey wants pancakes and eggs. So I think I'm just going to do two separate things for them. One mac and cheese for one of them. Pancakes and eggs for Lainey. And Millie will probably eat pancakes and eggs probably better than the mac and cheese so i think that's what we're gonna do for supper and ethan and i will just go out a little bit later when we're a little bit more hungry but i'm gonna make that for them um i'll bring y'all along tomorrow for our grocery haul and getting some decorating done probably go to hobby lobby and look at what walmart has and see if they have everything else i need hey are you fussy but i hope you guys enjoyed coming along with us today and Get some things to fill our house with and decor stuff and de decorations and different things. What are you doing with your eyes? What are you doing with your eyes? But I hope you guys enjoyed. Anyways, I'll see you soon for another video. Say bye. Daddy, do you bye. Bye.